one in. All right, this is um, Celebrity Edge, and we are in an Aqua Class cabin. This is an A1, cabin 10222. Okay, um, we're actually going to start at the Infinite Veranda. Uh, right now, you'll see that we have the blinds closed. When we return to our cabin in the evenings, it's very different. It's closed all of the way, and they open automatically. Ah, uh, but right now, it's noon, and we have just closed them about three quarters of the way just to show you what it looks like to open them. So we have a digital panel here that um, is great for adjusting the temperature, the lighting, as well as opening the blinds. So I just press that button and you'll see now that the blinds are opening. They open very slowly, but we're going to make our way there. Slowly. Slowly. <laughs> Again, this is an infinite veranda. Um, something that, that kind of took us by surprise is it's pretty small. Um, for some reason, we expected it to be larger, but I don't dislike it. Um, you might see a lot of negativity about it. You might see people raving about it. Mm -hmm. I think we're kind of somewhere in between. Um, it's small, but look how private this is. It's so incredibly private. Um, we cannot see our neighbors when this is open, and I will actually open it. Maybe, there we go. I'm gonna open this. When I stick my head out and I look both ways, I can't see anyone. It's completely private. I'm sorry, I'm not putting my phone out over the ocean, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. The other thing mm -hmm. that, that you'll notice is the walls go from floor, up floor to ceiling, complete privacy. For some reason, we expected when we booked this that this was going to be open air. I don't really know why we thought that, or at least a sunroof or something. But essentially, mm -hmm. the, uh, the ceiling out here is the same ceiling that you had inside your cabin. Uh, but it is it is pretty small, but I like it. Um, something that you have to do, though, is you have to open these up. You have to move the chairs out of the way in order to open the doors up, and you'll see that the doors fold. We just keep it open the whole time, and now it becomes an extension of our living space, which I really like just to sit. We had our wine out here last night, have a mimosa in the morning, read, whatever you feel like doing. But we like it. We like it a lot. Um, one thing you'll notice is a ton of storage space. I think this is really cool. This looks like a little end table, but actually it's storage. Hmm. It also becomes seating, if you'd like. Whoops. Lots of storage space here, mini fridge here. I want you to take a look at the extensive options for charging little charging station here. They give you binoculars, which we don't need, I think, on the sailing. This also moves out. You have a full-length mirror, but you can also use this as your vanity, if you'd like. I am, however you'd like to use it. We like it in because I like to have a... Can you, can you show how to turn off and on the light since it's not intuitive at all? Uh, you show me. Okay, sorry. So it's <laughs> down here. There we go. There you go. See? Ooh, it's exciting. All right. Um, I also like the couch with the ability to sit, stretch your legs, and look straight out at the water. I think that's really nice. Um, we have a king size bed. Something that's noticeable here, though, is the nightstand on this side is itty bitty tiny, but there is some shelving space for storage, which is great. Your phone, itty bitty tiny. Um, Huge screen, but look at the distance. This is pretty narrow. If you're a person um, of size, it could be challenging, I think, to, to walk through here. You'd have to go like you know, maybe sideways for some people. So um, the nightstand here is much larger than on the other side. You are gonna uh, wait until I show you the closet. Tons of space, and it's not just the main closet, but all right, so. We have all of our hanging clothes. We have drawers here. And when you sail Celebrity Edge, you will receive a safe. Is it an aqua safe? It's an aqua safe. <laughs> so it floats. No, I don't know. I'm yeah, not even going to try. Right? But you, you get a safe. But I want to show you more. There's more. We've got storage up here. We'll open them both at the same time. Well, okay. And that one. 
and this one, right? They're and magnets. They're this. kind they of a challenge to open. They're they, strong. Right. You'll see here, we're not using, this is, we're not using a lot. And I'm not going to walk in there, but we'll let uh, Travel Guy show you. The cool thing about the shower, because this is an aqua class cabin, is the shower heads. We have four different methods of obtaining water. You've got the rainfall, you've got the handheld, you've got a waterfall up there. Actually, it's five. Did I get that nope, wrong? No, it's four. Is it? Waterfall, rainfall, handheld, and then you've got the, the two that come straight out yeah. from the device there. That is also a mirror. I want you to note also, oh, yeah. above the sink, that's a no-fog mirror. So it's great to be able to come out of the shower and uh, your mirror is not fogged up. Very cool. And for everyone... Please note, this is actually a drawer. So you're gonna find your dryer right here. And of course my product there. The other uh, amenity in an aqua class is the upgraded um, shampoo, conditioner, body wash, body lotions, lip balm. So we have some upgraded um, toiletries in here as well. Um, as well as dining in blue um, and access to the spa, the relaxation room, the thermal loungers, uh, the sauna, steam room, so it's great. Also, the reason why this is non-fog is because it's heated. This is actually warm to the touch. It is. It, and it is. turns off when you turn off the lights and comes back on when you turn them on. And one more thing I want to show really quick is the USB ports right by the nightstand, which is pretty cool. And I think... I think that's, that's alles. That's alles. Juice.